1 Corinthians 13, 7. Love bears all things, it believes all things, it hopes all things, it endures all things. You see, the first few are pretty easy. The last one is super difficult. Love endures all things. That's pretty hard. The endure part actually comes from the Greek word hupomeno, which is a compound word that actually means under and remain. But a better visual of it is it's a lot of scholars believe it's like if I'm in battle and I'm going against the army and they're collapsing on all sides and everybody else starts to retreat, that I don't, that I hold firm on my post. I don't give an inch. When other people hesitate, you don't. When they back down, you don't. When you fl other people flinch, you don't. Love endures. Hupamina, the visual is a soldier not giving way. You see, the same word that's used in 1 Corinthians 13 of how we're supposed to love, how I'm supposed to love, to bear all things, to believe all things, to hope all things, and to endure all things, that same word was also used in Hebrews 12 when it says, Jesus endured the cross. It's the same word. It's the same hoopamento word. The same way he had love for you and love for me to endure the cross when it sucked, when it was hard, when it was difficult. It's the same way we're called to love people.